We took our eye off this enormous threat, and now it's, it's now upon us. It's now inside the gates. The Chinese Communist Party is here in America. 美国国务卿蓬佩奥警告，中国共产党就在美国大门之内。他一月四号接受英文大纪元专访，记者提出，中共最害怕面对的迫害法轮功二十一年问题。On International Human Rights Day, you actually sanctioned a Chinese official for gross human rights violations against Falun Gong practitioners. But why do you think it took so long? 蓬佩奥坦言，世界热爱自由的人们透过历史与1989天安门事件，已经认知中共政权本质，但却忽略了中共威胁。如今，中共已在美国境内。A complicated question. We ignored it in part because we had a、uh, foreign policy establishment that believed deeply that if we、uh, traded enough stuff with them, if we engaged with them, that the, some other Chinese Communist Party would engage at least externally in the world on a, a fair and reciprocal basis, and, and that was that was. Patently false all the way through, and yet the resistance from lots of quarters was enormous for a host of reasons. Pompeo, 二零二零年七月二十号发表声明，中共对法轮功学员二十一年的迫害已太长太久，必须立刻停止。川普政府将宗教自由列为外交政策首要事务，成立不可剥夺权利委员会，组成国际宗教与信仰自由联盟，尤其关切中共。蓬佩奥解释，希望让外交政策立足美国传统。Tradition. It's at the center of every civilization, and if you get that piece wrong,、uh, bad things flow from that. Lots of diplomatic things flow, military bad. Lots of bad things flow from that. These things that are fundamental affronts to human dignity are something that is a hallmark of authoritarian regimes. And Trump 对中政策区分中共与中国。蓬佩奥表示，这很重要。中国历史有许多朝代充满故事。这块土地上的是好人。过去五十年，在中国发生一些最庞大的悲剧，那不是人民造成的。我们要尊重中国人。I am confident that the Chinese people want a different path forward. They want their freedoms, and it is the Chinese Communist Party denying them. It is important to keep them separate. We have, and we hope that they too will join the call. To change the nature of how this regime behaves in its international activities. 新唐人亚太电视李进章、东旭整理报道。